Hey guys, what's going on? And here we are at the DMV site on Grand Theft Auto. And you guys are probably like, oh, Tyler, why are we at the DMV site on Grand Theft Auto? And I'm like, well, because I'm going to test my driving knowledge. And we're going to take the test. So let's get this show on the road. When is it permissible to run a red light? Never. It's illegal. When there are no police around, when you're too late for an audition or you woke up after a blackout, when you're convicted that minority in the other car, <laughs> convinced, sorry, that the minority in the other car is going to murder you for no apparent reason apart from the fact that they're probably foreign. Um, I'm going to go with B. The correct driving position is seat in an upright position with one hand gripping the steering wheel at 6 o'clock. B. Slumped down below window level with the seat fully reclined, smoking a massive fatty for medical purposes. One hand down your pants, the other sexting while in the seat pushed forward so you can steer with your knees. Tearing down the freeway at 100 miles an hour while applying makeup, drinking a 40 ounce bean machine. Gunkachino and updating your life invader status. Um, yeah, that, that's, that's what I'm going to go with. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> when getting serviced or <laughs> driving, the correct course of action is blast an 80s rock power ballad to get her in the mood. Look for potholes to increase her pleasure. No, our pleasure. Took Cameron. <laughs> uh, be sure to wrap your seatbelt around her head for safety. I would say look for potholes. How much gin and juice can you safely consume while operating a vehicle? None. Even a small amount of alcohol can impair your driving abilities. One to two. Who cares? You'll rarely get above five miles an hour in <laughs> Los Angeles anyway. I'm in recovery, I'm an addict, I have a sobriety chip, I'm the annoying person. No. Yeah, who cares, honestly. What is an important safety tip when backing up? Honk a horn a few times. <laughs> Push back slowly and purr if you like that, don't you? <laughs> the pound hard, then pound hard. Turn up the radio, start backing up and ask your passion. Yep, 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 yep. Alrighty. Who has the right of way when the four cars approach a four way stop? I do. The car with the racist bumper stickers. The person on your right. Never stop at a sign, it makes you look like a turd. I would have to say that because I'm a Californian. When stopping to pick up a prostitute, always leave the car running in case shit gets real. Pick the station that is soft and romantic to set the vibe. Pull your wallet under the seat in case she tries to roll you. Um. You know, I I would do all of the above, but what needs to be romantic about a prostitute? So, I would probably leave the car running in case shit got real. You come over a hill and are the first person to scene of an accident. People are hurt. You should. Save any hot college girls first as they will be indebted to you sexually. Search the area for loose change and discharge that discharged with the cars rolled. Post some pics on Bleeder with hashtags, this dude's dying, oh my god. Leave the area quickly, let the law enforcement sort it out, you don't need the hassle of other human beings suffering. I would say save the hot college chicks. You're driving outside the city on rural roads, and your car breaks down. Yeah, you're fucked. Tell anyone that stops that you're diseased, why? Start running, don't look back, oh, what the fuck, yeah, no, we're fucked. When stopped in traffic, use soda bottles to urinate in. Weave in and out of traffic as much as possible. I actually do that. That's terrible. Send out bleats about how bad traffic is. You are really important. Maintain calm. You will get there eventually. Then jump out and murder the person who just got you off. Ooh, so I'm tied between weaving in and out and killing people. I'll stay with weaving in and out. I failed. Either try again or take a cab. Or the metro. Haha. -ha. 
You have to ride the Metro, loser. Seriously, you're a loser. No wonder everyone hates you. Wow, that was harsh. Damn. Alright. Well, shit. Anyway, guys. <laughs> if you like the video, subscribe.